Hey everybody, uh, it's a solo PUBG episode. Let me explain what the heck's going on there, because you might be a little bit confused about things. Um, basically, we, for the first time in 100 days, our schedules have gotten to the point where we have one day where we don't have a Let's Go episode of Battlegrounds. So, um, I thought about what we could do, and it seems like, for my taste, I just like to make like a replacement kind of solo episode with the knowledge that it's not going to be like the same level of, um, oh, you know, that's my, okay, well, you know what? I'm taking some of the bullets then. Um, it's not going to be the same level of banter, and that's fine, but it's only for one day, and maybe we'll have some fun times and learn a little bit about ourselves in the process. Like, that dude is super dead. Plus, if I win solo in the one episode I record... Uh, without those other jokers, then I get to hold it over their heads forever. Even though the odds of this happening are essentially zero, I'm excited about the potentiality. Da, 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 da. By the way, this is way too freaking loud. I understand. Let me let me lower the volume somewhat. I'm also on my new uh, PC, so this also serves as stop shooting. Stop shooting. Thank you. It also serves a little bit as like a, uh, a test episode, you know? I've done a lot of tests, I've, I've done a couple hours actually of testing to see, oh, we're on C dot, no doubt. Um, a couple hours of testing to get settings more optimal, but uh, we'll see. This is a good opportunity for you guys to give me some feedback. But yeah, you know, Battlegrounds is actually like 100% not going anywhere. Um, it's just, I mean, Dan has a son. Mike's girlfriend is here from overseas. I was away for a week leading up to it. Um, you know, our schedules have conflicted to the point where it's hard for us to find, uh, or at least this one time, it was hard for us to find time uh, to make it happen. So, enjoy this little solo episode here in the meantime. Um, there's like 30 people here. That's all right. I can get a uh, dodecahedron kill and then ascend to true Battlegrounds royalty. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be spicy at the top of CDOT, but it doesn't really matter because we have Micro's personal Uzi as well as a crossbow. Just cool your freaking jets, dude. I mean, I know that that dude is going to see me. But that's what the crossbow's for. Can you, put a, you can put a red dot on a crossbow. What? Dude, you don't know how lucky you are. <laughs> I shot you. At point blank range. With a crossed bow. You think he knows? You think he knows? Just be cool. Just be cool. I see your arm, dude. Easiest kill of my life. Dude, did he have a crossbow bolt sticking out of him? If so, I've never been madder. I guess he didn't have anything, and that's why he was scared. But I was scared in the process as well. You know, we were both scared. Now I'm thinking the audio level's too low, but it's okay. You don't, you know how the game sounds at this point? Because no, wait, 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 wait. We want to roll Mike Rose personal Uzi. As far as I'm concerned, we already got um, a successful kill. Somebody's in this building. Just lay low. They're either in this building or like right next to it. Now, was it the easiest kill of all time? I mean, it was up there. I'm actually going to raise the volume again. It was up there. 
But as far as I'm concerned, we should have had a parachute shooting gallery kill as well. I hear footsteps. Oh, God. Okay, get ready. It's Daisy all over again. They're beneath me right now? You know he's gonna come up here and he's gonna... He's like, oh, there's a corpse in here. What's going on with that? And then we put our zeroing distance way up. <laughs> we can't fit the shotgun. He's looting. He's confused. He's going... Oh! Jesus Christ. I know, you're saying be more aggressive. Be more aggressive. Look, you, you play your game, I play my game, okay? I see ya. I'm not taking a shot at him, though. I might take a shot at him, because I, I desire hit points above all else. Now, did that just let this dude know that I'm here? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Come get a taste, big boy. You shoot at the champ, you best not miss. Generally speaking, Mike Rose, personal Uzi, on single is not how you want to live your life. I just got to remember, what would Austin do? Probably run out there and get like a quad kill. And then get bested in a duel and blame it on server desync. Well, you know what? When in Rome, buddy. When in Rome. Render unto Caesar that which is Caesar's. Caesar's palace. Roll the dice. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, we know there's a dude down here. I hear footsteps again. These ones might actually be on top of me. Did you hear that? I don't like being here. But you know what they say. Carpe diem. Seize the dot. I think he's like directly on top of me right now. So here's what you do. Get a little angle. I see you. Think he might be aware of where I am now, but dude. Seize the dot. I don't like this over the shoulder. Is there any way to change that? Can't recall. Doesn't matter. We're a, we're knight of the freaking hunter right here. Let's go, buddy. I got the adrenaline coursing through my veins. I'm all hopped up on motivational quotes and ready to learn some skills. You ever hear the expression stay frosty? That's what we got to do right now. Just stay frosty. He who moves first dies worst hello my friend we meet again it's been a while where do we begin let's go somebody else is here Dude, that was actually, like, one of the best kills I've ever had. We are safe from the blue. 
We're not safe from anything else, though. We're not quite the Lords of CDOT yet. I heard footsteps below me. This building's been a little bit of a nightmare so far. Oh, oh, he's so close. He's so close. Door's gonna open like that, so be ready. He's close, dude. All these other doors are open. He's gotta know something's up. He's sneaking. He's sneaking. He smells death in the air. I want him to open like four doors before he gets to this one. So he'll get into a false sense of security. It's like a horror movie. You open one door and you go, oh, nothing. Then you hear like, Wow, and it's just the cat. And you go, oh, Mr. Jenkins. And then you see like the flash of a kitchen knife behind you. And nothing personnel, kid. It's NL. With Micro's personal Uzi. Man, in solo PUBG, you really spend a lot of time just looking at closed doors, huh? But tension is in the air. You hear these doors. I know you hear them. That was right next to me. Surely... That's our final enemy. I do want to point out, uh, we never got hit in the process there. Just throwing that out there as a potential cause to say, way to go, NL. There are still people at CDOT. But we've become a miniature lord of CDOT. Please tell me... There's not one extra dude doing exactly the same thing I'm doing. I mean, I think you want the red dot on this. Just... Oh, he's got a murdered out umpy. But only 28 bullets. So I think we're better off... Right. I mean, we got touched by the blue. For like a quarter of a second. Did you... Did a light just turn on there? I'm very afraid. But we have to go. I'm just trying to see if there was like... A vehicle or something. Apparently there was. <laughs> um, yeah, let's, let's run and see how we did this. Okay, so first off... I'm stoked. We were like a king of CDOT. As far as I'm concerned, successful video now, one way or the other. Now what we want to do is, uh, I mean, we're probably going to die on the bridge is my guess. But if we go to the road, we might be able to make it across the bridge. And I'll be straight up with you. I didn't expect spicy CDOT drop to work for us. So I'm thinking that we'll probably just try to find a spot and hole up. Hold up? Which, what do they say? Hole up or hold up? I wouldn't mind getting a 4 or 8x for this car. It's not my ideal weapon choice if I'm being honest, but... Wouldn't dispute it, but... Dude, I... 
I mean, how many times have I said in the Battlegrounds episodes, I find Solo an easier game? Because basically, all you do is camp, and as long as you shoot first, you win. It's a dream come true for someone like yours truly. So we gotta be very, 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 very cautious here. Any one of these houses could have people in it, but we sort of have to go along the road anyway. Because if there's a vehicle, that allows us to make it past the bridge. I'm gonna assume that by this point, probably like all boats have been taken. I don't like driving the boats anyway. You know, for like 10 seconds, you feel like you're in Miami Vice and then you, you're dead forever. I know Austin would take issue with that, but just keep your head on a swivel. Keep your stick on the ice. And if the ladies don't find you handsome, they should at least find you handy. You know, red, green. So the bridge is a nightmare. Um, I don't know if I really want to swim, though. Well, if we swim next to the bridge, we might actually... Be able to live for a little while. Oh, those doors are open, dude. That's bad. I see one. We're gonna die in the blue here, I think. Did I see one, or is that a... Was that a little mark on my monitor? Might have been a monitor mark. No, it was not. There was a dude in there. Just letting you know, how many red dots do you need, right? Just letting you know, dude, we don't have to do this. But I gotta swim. There's lyrics to the song. Put your hands at the back of my neck. Sitting down on rooftops. Remember when everything you said. Remember this one? Swim to me the edge. Now I'm steady, not too different. Don't drown. On who can you depend? Classic. Surfer blood, I think? I don't know. It's been a while. Anyway, we might take a little damage from the blue, but we've... We made the right decision to get out of the dot of sea before things got, like, really bad. But this is, uh... Oftentimes kind of a death sentence Because you're, you're really getting out on the beach like next to nothing Not to mention you're in the water the whole time to begin with now the water is actually like very very safe But um, what's not safe is the beach so if the circle doesn't end around these rocks, we're going to have a little bit of a hard time, I think. But honestly, I'm very pleased with the way this episode has gone so far. Not only, now we can actually, like, start to toot our own horn a little bit. Not only... Is that a person or a bush right there? Dead center. I'm scared. Not only... Did we survive that personal nightmare? We uh, didn't get hit at all, which is amazing to me. To get three kills without getting hit is like, it's not quite Austin level, but it might be mouth level. New circle is very, very far away. We're gonna spend like the whole run running from this freaking circle. But if they bridge trolled, there might be some vehicles over there. There's only 29 people left because the circles were very cruel. And, you know, it's not... It usually doesn't take as long to get to the subsequent circles. The problem is if you ever find yourself in a gun battle with somebody who's already in the circle, like, cancel Christmas, dude. Is that a boat? I almost drowned. can't tell, the waves are too high def. So here's my plan. We know there's people at the bridge. 
I don't want to fight them. Because I'm a baby. So I kind of wanted to peep the road. See if there were cars. We are not moving towards the circle in this case, though. Is really like oh, it's an ooh ah, 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 ah. We gotta go. Okay, um, just camp out like basically here. Go to dead center of the circle. This is NL's game plan. Okay, stop. This is how I live my life. He says before getting shot in the head while driving a car and dying. If you don't watch very much Battlegrounds, you might think that this is like a normal occurrence. We actually beat the bridge trolls. That never happens. It, unless we're the bridge trolls, in which case it happens every time. So I just want to uh, avoid the rockiest ground. And then find safety in numbers here. Like, that house I really like, actually. Even though it's in Milta. I like it a lot. So I have marked this oh, place. But I'm not a cartographer in Battlegrounds, okay? I'm just a normal boy. So I don't remember what this house... Oh, it's a freaking mushy. I, I have now become an anti-mush. I'm not a mush man anymore. You will not kill me. I cannot be killed. There's another mush. I don't want to be in a yellow house either, though. Still, sh still, still shooting at me. Another car coming. This is hell. Keep driving, buddy. Keep driving. I see the 4X. I don't think he's gotten out. Obviously, I hate this and I'm an idiot. But I smell... some potential kills. At logging. Of all places. We gotta be very, very careful here. Where do you think we were getting shot from? <sighs> I don't love it, if I'm being honest. Turns out we should have stayed closer to Milta, maybe. Oh, new vest. Who dis? Well, obviously, one person knows we're in here. You think they were shooting us from houses? No, don't. No airplanes. I don't acquiesce to allow you to give me airplanes here. Well, the way I see it, we got two options. We could try to run the hills. dum da dum dum da dum or, we could get back in the car. And try to make it down there. But I really don't like our odds in the hills with somebody who's already n knows where we are, you know? But that guy might be dead. <laughs> I don't like having logging at our backs here, because it's like... It's so busy. If that was just an open field, I'd be stoked, but... Logging is dangerous. Mostly, I just want the cheesiest kills of all time. If you could hook me up, please. Mushy is a death trap. I'll level with you. So let's mark a spot. This is it, this might get us killed, but it's also like seize the day. 
Carpe DM. I think if we stay there, we're gonna die as well. The only question is uh, whether it's gonna be from the blue or otherwise. Did I actually mark another mushy? No, I didn't. Good call. Smart one. The car has crushed me. What's wrong with those houses? Absolutely nothing. You know what? I think I've decided this is where we get out of that car. This looks unlooted to me. Well, there's a level one backpack. It does not mean it's unlooted. We don't really care about an M16. Oh, we do care about an M16, but we gotta be fast. Why? It's got different bullets than the car. It also does fire and burst, which is worse usually, but gotta give it a shot. Plus we're safe in circle number two. Might as well slam a bread bowl. Well, we got a chance here. Dude, we might make it top 10 in our solo game. Best run ever? No, but it's a start, you know. We got no suppy. That's a problem. Officially top 10. And top 10 with three kills? You guys are probably... I know from playing with other people. You're probably seeing folks left, right, and center. I'm jealous. Claps up the hill. To me, that sounds like it's coming from the blue. Keep your head on a freaking swivel. Because you know if somebody's in a bush, they're going to pop up. I got to admit, I'm getting a little shaky, getting a little anxious here. You don't expect take one to be this good. So the other problem is they could come from over here. That's like a big blind spot because there's a wall there. They could be in yellow houses. There's a jeep at yellow houses. And I don't know if it's derelict. Well, if they were in yellow, they would have run by now. Hmm. Very interesting. This circle's gonna be a bloodbath. And I'm gonna be a part of it. So where would I wanna be? trying to get a lay of the land out here there's a little trench sort of thing there six left I think we leave we try to get behind this rock like right here if it's safe. We got 30 seconds though. Just trying to get, like, I don't have high hopes here. I'm just looking for any intel. And from playing with Austin, I know his strats. 
You move with the circle. Because then you're moving with everybody else. Five people left. Would I give us a 20% chance? No. But we are in it. I don't see him, but I hear him. At this point, my goal is basically to be the last one to fire. Even though those are that's an easy kill, obviously. What can I say? I don't always know what's good for me. I actually care zero about anything but safety. I think the tree right here is safe. At least from one side. The ridge scares the crap out of me. But. We'll see. Ideally, they fight each other. And I clean up the scraps. No! No! Third place! I should have let him fight, but I knew if I had to move, we'd be in trouble anyway, so... Dude, I'm like... My voice is quivering here. Great game! And hopefully you guys enjoyed this little interlude while we wait for, uh... The next episode of... Oh, I can't afford it. While we wait for the next episode of, uh, Real Battlegrounds. But for now, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. But for now... Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Let's go.